Channing here for day one of the 12 days of Channing. Uh, I'm hoping to have a few winners and see if we can win some money in the run to Christmas. Now today, obviously, uh, we don't have too much racing going on because of the weather, uh, but there is a meeting at Lingfield, uh, and I think I found a bet in the 320, the last race on the card. Um, it's, a, it's a nine runner race over 10 furlongs, and the horse in question is Hot Day. Uh, now, Hot Day, um, he has run quite a lot of times and he's only won once uh, from 16 starts. Uh, and that was a win uh, off of a rating of 60. Uh, but he's going down the weights a little bit and um, he's only really been running over 10 furlongs the last couple of times. He did have one other run over that distance. He generally is a bit slow away uh, over the shorter distances and stays on strongly. Two runs recently over 10 furlongs. Uh, both times he's found a bit of trouble in running and both times from a wide draw. I'm hoping today, and last time I thought he was quite unlucky actually, uh, and the handicapper decided to drop him two pounds, so he's running off 53, uh, which is seven pounds below um, his, his sole winning mark. Uh, he's got a better draw in trap four, and um, Luke Morris is on, and I just thought to myself, well look, he, he was a bit unlucky last time, he still came third, he looked like he could have won the race. <clears throat> I think today, at a price of nine to four, he just looks like a solid favourite to me. I'm not going to get too carried away. We're on a scale of one to ten. I'm going to start the week, start the challenge with a, a two points to win at the nine to four with Star Sports. So the best of luck. Hopefully we can get off to a winning start. <laughs>